This proposed bill would provide emergency security deposit relief to those who need it. You're moving from another rental to another rental, so you got to make sure you cover that rental final payment plus come up with the first month's rent at the new place plus a deposit. Yeah, so it can be pretty tough. Baltimore renters say getting into an apartment can be challenging. The pandemic made it worse. Due to COVID, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people lost a lot of income, a lot of money. City Council President Nick Mosby says housing security is a big concern in Baltimore and says when the moratorium on evictions is lifted July 1st, the issue will get worse. One of the biggest barriers to getting access to quality housing is the security deposit. His proposal would help through a grant program. This will be money that you'll be able to come to the city. You'll be able to ask the city for that relief. The city will provide that voucher for that relief that's available to you for 180 days um, once you get it. And you'll be able to utilize that for your security deposit, up to $2,000. Mosby says the city could use $2.5 million in HUD money to pay for the program. Council Vice President Sharon Middleton is the bill's co-sponsor. In my heart, I know it's a way that um, we, an option, and that's why we're continuing with another type of legislation that's going to try to push this through and I'm hoping the mayor will meet and understand and work with us to together to get this through. Middleton will introduce the bill at Monday's council meeting. Lisa Robinson, WBAL TV 11 News.